1787, Richard Humphreys defeated Daniel Mendoza in the first of their three fights by using a rabbit punch. The rabbit punch is illegal in modern boxing and is banned across many fighting sports. And the reason it's banned is that you can kill somebody with it and you can paralyze them with it. The punch is a strike from the inside where you hit the opponent just below the base of the skull at the top of the neck right here. It's done from an infighting position and while I can't advocate for using it in a modern setting, let's have a look at it. So we're here with our opponent fighting and I've managed to get around them and hold them right here on the back of their skull and pull them down into a front headlock position. So that their head is here, face pointing down, their neck is here and their body comes backwards. From here, I'm gonna strike down on the back of the neck, on the base of the neck, like this. That's all there is to it. Let's have a look at it on the back. So I've managed to get my opponent, their head down. Their face is here, their body is here. From here, it's a simple punch. So we're fighting, I managed to slip through, grab the neck, pull them down, keep their head tight into your chest, hand holding that round part of the back of their skull so they're in nice and tight. And you lift up, That's the rabbit punch. Very effective punch from in fight. Definitely something that you shouldn't use in day to day fighting because you'll definitely hurt somebody pretty badly. But it was, it was used for 150 years in boxing until it was banned under the Marquis of Queens Queensbury rules. One more time. Grab the head, pull it down into the chest. <laughs> 